All right, let's get the correct. All right. What we got for options? Not much. Okay. Grandpa! Grandpa literally broke my sword on purpose. It's just a dumb stick and it was on accident. You didn't even ask if you could borrow it. You were jelly. Uh-uh, you just didn't want to share. You're selfish. Settle down, children. Don't you know having a sibling is a special thing? You must learn to share and be nice to one another. You know, I have the perfect story for a night like this. If you two can't behave, we can go to sleep instead. No, we'll be good. Come and gather around. This tale is about a mischievous Minotaur King and his young prince. Sounds cool. Am I in the story again, Grandpa? Oh ho ho, you are, and guess what? Chris as well. Our story begins on a special day for the people of Blossom. Does a sleepyhead king rule there, Grandpa? Or a grumpy wizard with a ginormous head? No lords or castles here. Only a small village and a girl named after a brave hero from very long ago. The Minotaur Moon Festival is just getting started. Movement isn't as fast. Kind of weird. There we go. We got a roll. Roll uses stamina. Tavern owner's mushroom soup is from an old age recipe. Hello, citizens of Blossomdale, and welcome to the Minotaur Moon Festival. Please enjoy our games. They commemorate the Minotaur battle fought long ago. Today is the tournament honoring the heroes who fought against the dread Minotaur King. Those who wish to participate must bring me five Minotaur coins. Now then, let our special 500th Minotaur Moon Festival celebration commence. Thank you. 
Wow, look at those beefy biceps. You look like you have what it takes to play my game. When a ball drops, throw it in the bas open basket. Want to try? Sure. You ever thought about playing basketball? Hello. Hello. How are you, Brid? How's your night going? Hello there, my game tests your skills wielding the noblest of weapons. Wanna play? Destroy all the dummies before the time is up. Good luck! Good, had to end it early, but no big deal. How's your day been? Uh, I yes, it was going. I tr I was trying Parasite Eve 2, and I ran into a technical hiccup that I'm gonna have to solve before I can play it. Uh, I hit a room where the animation or the the emulation just slowed way down. Uh, one emulator I tried wouldn't load past the first screen, and the second one did really well until I got to a certain room, and then it was just like, uh, no. So we're going to pivot to Blossom Tales until I can get the emulation fixed on it, which I have a couple other options to do. One of which is just loading the ROM on the PS3 and playing it that way, but that's kind of a pain in the ass, if I'm being honest. I could try and put it on the, on the PS TV and see how it does there. It just, it just completely slowed way down, and I don't know, I, I mean, I could tell exactly what was causing it. There was, there was a transparency effect from water, and it was just causing all sorts of problems. It is time for the Minotaur Moon Tournament. Prepare for our grand battle, all in good fun to celebrate the Minotaur King's demise. First match between Lily and Kevin from our post office. I'm expecting, really grandpa, the mail guy? What's he gonna do, give you paper cuts with letters? How about an adventurous swordsman from a faraway land? Boring, it should be a fierce night with a cool lance. All right, all right, Um, what were those choices again? Well, Brid. What hell will you put me through today? Oh, we've got one for Jouster, we've got one for Swordsman. Uh-oh. And hello, the Hansmeister. How's your night going? All right, swordsman. And the winner is Lily. What a fighting spirit. Lily's next opponent will be the legendary Sir Vigo Mondoya. Oh, wow. I still think Lily should fight the knight. I think it should be a hulking brute that throws rocks. Wait, who are they again? J. 
Jouster or Hulking Brute. <laughs> we have another choice here. Well, it's unanimous. Lily wins again! My, where'd you learn to fight like that? The Crusher! <laughs> Her brother. Hey, you can't do that. Now, kids. Too late, he's already there and ready to kick your butt. If you look at that, Lily's final opponent is none other than her brother, Chris. You're here for a thrilling sibling brawl, folks. Final round, fighters ready, begin. Ow, that really hurt. Please wait, sis. Oh no, are you hurt? Sensing that her brother was hurt, Lily did the honorable thing and stopped her attack. She did so because even though siblings may fight, deep down they care for each other. Crap. I was gonna say, but then Chris at least a sneak attack on his sister. No, you cheater, that's not fair, Grandpa. The crowd cheered for Chris, the tournament champion. Three cheers for Chris, the tournament champion. You're such a brat, Chris. Now, kids. Hey, it's just a story where, where I'm the champion. Nah, nah. <laughs> sure, I wish. I wish the Minotaur King would come to take you away. Oh, no. Did she just... Did she, did she just labyrinth him? She just wished that David Bowie would come and take her brother away? Oh, that is so fucked. She's even... She's even doing it! She's not, like, just throwing it out there. No, she's actually doing it. Oh, Minotaur King, oh, Minotaur King, wherever you may be, I wish you'd take my brother far away from me. I mean, you did mean it. You absolutely meant it. Like, it wasn't like you just said it and then we're like, oh, I'm so sorry. No, you, you, you did the whole incantation there, Lily. Dang, Grandpa, I've been kidnapped? That's sort of cool. <laughs> the Minotaur King stole Chris away. He did indeed. Far, far away, just like you said. We all make mistakes, honey. Don't feel bad. Your brother was annoying as shit. In the old graveyard north of town. Thanks, Grandma. I hope you didn't need those, uh, hope you didn't need those chairs or that, you know, those barrels or things. One apple. 
Two apples. I don't know what I'm collecting apples for. Clover. There's a dig spot, so clearly we have we're getting the shovel in this game again. Salutations, Wishmaker. I'm Stan, the famous traveling trader. I come from a long line of salespeople, but I want to bring back the art of trading. All this obsession with monetary units doesn't sit right with me, you know, plus coins are heavy. Do you know what else is heavy? The brand spanking new weight on your shoulders. Saving your brother from powerful hooved wizards with horns doesn't sound easy, but you're in luck! As my great 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 grandpappy used to say, I've got what you need. Wow. Okay. I can't believe she David Bowie'd, or she, she labyrinthed her brother. That's just fucked up. Nope, nothing in there. No, I don't need hearts, game. I need... I need apples and shit, apparently. The new the new kids cereal, apples and shit. <laughs> Coming to store shelves near you. Hello Lily, how are you today? Well, it's good to know that I can just farm these things if I need to. Hi, Lily. I'm just taking a break. I like how her grandma's like, Oh, it's absolutely no problem that you got your brother murdered. No problem. No problem whatsoever. It's a very understanding grandma. Ah, you thought that your, you thought that your meager possessions were safe. You know, uh, I, I think I preferred it when the salespeople took coins. I'm just saying. If I had the materials, for some reason I'm not getting shipments from Anchor Town. Who rules Anchor Town? Master Blaster rules Anchor Town. Hi, Lily. Oh, you saw the Help Wanted poster outside. He lives in the northeast corner of town. Got it.
Oh, that's a nice quality of life improvement. Oh my gosh, the letter about the Minotaur King. I can't wait to tell my brother about him. Um, the, the little envelope over their heads when you have a letter for them is really nice. I... That's just, yeah, that's a much appreciated quality of life change. Oh, welcome back. Here's 10 gold. The Emerald Jungles? Man, I don't... I don't want to go to the Emerald Jungles. Can you just... Give me more local deliveries and then... Like, think it'd be like DoorDash, not... Not EPS. Suppose I should go north. Wow. Am I too late for the festival? Serves me right for trying to use this dang habit, dang nabbit thing. Allow me to introduce myself. Grand Sky Wizard Cornelius the Blue. And this contraption is my most recent invention, a magic hot air balloon. Why magic? <laughs> One can summon it from any of the balloon platforms I made across the kingdom. Sadly, I've just discovered I have a crippling fear of heights. <laughs> Took me over seven hours to get here. I had to fly real low and real slow. Feel my beautiful balloon will never majestically take to the skies. Unless perhaps it can be of use to you. When you find a platform, use it to call my magic balloon and fly to other platforms you've found. Happy floating! I'm not gonna lie, the, the humor is hitting a lot better in this game. Everything is a little bit better in this game. The uh, the sprite art is a little bit better. The user interface is just a little bit better. Ugh, how long have I been here? I only sat down for a quick rest. I was trying to enter the catacombs when a bunch of wrath wrathful specters attacked me. You're trying to get inside too, huh? Not worth it, believe me. You ain't afraid of no ghosts, huh? God damn it. I admire your courage. Use this lantern to fend off those spirits and brighten things up around here. Listen, game, I can't get out.
aim. So when you're stuck in a cutscene, apparently the uh, the enemies just keep moving. That's that's a that's a negative. So, uh, so for it, last night's last night's Pathfinder game was pretty spectacular. I'm not gonna lie, only because I had to I had to take off the GM hat for a second and be like, "Yo, please stop." Like the 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 party got it in their heads that they needed to leave town to do. A thing. And we're playing a, uh, we're playing, we're playing a Pathfinder adventure path. And it's, it's very specifically plotted out, right? But the party got it in their heads anyway, that they needed to leave town to go into the forests and basically consult with some goblins who were uh, who had raided the town that they're in and oh we are already doing this shit huh okay well yeah oh what the fuck game that's really fucking annoying man those ghosts they just will they'll trap you and there's like nothing you can really do uh so anyway like i they had arranged for a guide to to take them into the wilderness to these goblin camps right like they thought that they were gonna like i don't know i don't know if they were gonna murder them i don't know if they were gonna ask them questions i don't know Point is that the book was the book is actually pretty specific in that uh, it even had a, a note in there that said your players may want to try and leave town to to speak to the goblins. Don't don't let them. Just don't. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, okay. So what I did was one of the one of the characters is a, is a rich aristocrat. So I just had it be that the that the the guide thought that they were full of shit and left like they're like i don't have time to, to to let some rich aristocrat like go on a tour of the woods right old king hey it's the king from the first game and so uh oh hey cox is doing its thing great it chose it chose now to start doing its bullshit fucking fantastic Anyway, uh, so it, it, so they, I said, so the, so their guide leaves them, right? And they're like, well, we'll just go anyway. We'll just go out of town where we don't really know where we're going and, and find it, right? And so that I had an NPC come up to them and be like, all, yo, somebody's missing. I need your help. And they're like, cool. And we will help you with that once we get back to town. And I'm like, fuck my life. So then I had another NPC come up and be like, yo, hey, we found a dead body over by this other thing that you had been asked to investigate like three or four sessions ago, right? And like, they were like, oh yeah, we'll check that out once we get back. And finally I had to like take off the GM hat for a second and be like, yo, <laughs> I need you to not, I need you to not go out into the wilderness. Like... I tried so hard to in in game to like get them to stay and they were just like not having it like uh...
Right? That's exactly... Like it's it's one of the few times I've have I've ever had to like like actually break the fourth wall and be like you're you're trying to go right I need you to go left like Yeah. I dub thee a true knight, accept my gifts, and with them my royal blessing. Travel southeast to the Emerald Jungles to seek out the being known as Morkla. May the spirit of the knights who long defended this realm endure in thee. Fun fact, uh, I have to go there to deliver an, um, uh, a, a letter anyway. I'm, I really hate Cox right now. Meanwhile, far away in the dungeons of the Minotaur King's Palace. Wake up. Hello, Chris. I apologize for these temporary barbaric accommodations. It is my it is a pleasure to meet you formally. I am the Minotaur King. I know who you are. Let me out of here. That's what I'm here to do. But when I open your cell, where will you go? Home, duh. Lily must feel really bad for what she did. She owes me big time. Is that what you think? I'm not so sure she cares at all. She made a wish, did she not? She sent you here with me. Well, yeah, but she hasn't even tried to save you, has she? I don't think she feels bad at all. Don't you see, Chris? Your sister remembered something. She was happier before you were born. Wow! Oof, that stings. Hee <laughs> hee, keep going, Grandpa. <laughs> Fucking A. That's not true. Without you, she gets Grandma to herself. She doesn't... Ooh, that sounds gross. She doesn't have to share. She gets all the attention. Why not stay with me? I won't hurt you. In fact, you'll be quite important here. Really? Does that mean I'd get my own room and stuff? Of course, you can have those things and many more as my Minotaur Prince, heir to my throne. Minotaur Prince, huh? I guess I could stay for a while. Marvelous! Ah ha 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 ha! Ah, but Lily was looking for Chris. With royal weapons in hand, she began heading southeast towards the Emerald Jungles. I saw a thing that I think I can cut, but I'm not 100% sure. You, can I cut you? Go away, ghost. Sure can. Slash, slash.
Fun fact. Bird decided to leave his cage today. No idea what caused him to take make that decision. Oh yeah, after eight eight years of being bird in cage, I'm gonna decide to pop on out for a bit of flappity flap flap. Okay. Tell me tell me bird is still in house at least. Good, good. Uh, I had an ant who had a parakeet for a lot of years, and it escaped out a window. I need all three? Oh my lord, that is a lot. I thought it was like, pick one. That is some, some royal horse shit, sir. But boy, was he not happy. This happened when I was a kid, so yeah, it was like... I remember the bird. Like, that's... It's funny, because that's like... The only thing I remember my aunt's old apartment for was because she had that, that parakeet. We're clearly going to get bombs again, because there's bomb rocks. Nope, can't swim yet. <laughs> uh. Does your how is your cat with bird? Let me ask you though, uh, 
Have you ever rolled over your cat with your office chair? No, they don't really get to interact. Cat doesn't get to be in bird room. Sometimes she slips in and will look at the bird in the cage, but doesn't approach. Gotcha. Step right up, miss. Would you like to play a game of chance? It's only 30 gold coins to play. Sure. Bees! Never gonna risk it. My cat is a uh, beep OMG like the paw or the tail. Thankfully, no. Oh, God, that would be terrible. Yeah, uh, you know, it sure would. I, I happen to know somebody who did that once accidentally. Oh, that's a painful. Come on now. Sin, would you like to play the money making game? I I hate the money making game to be honest. This isn't even the money making game. This is the this is the give me a piece of of heart game or piece of stamina game. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Finally. If Lily finds three more pieces of these special crystals, she'll have more energy. I think we're going to get to plant something. Yep, something large. If only Lily had the seed. I think the lesson that I learned tonight is that I need to just go ahead and play PS1 games on actual hardware when possible, meaning either the PS3 or the PS TV. Well, the spiders are bigger in this game. Thank you for the 25 bits, Brid. I'm going to offer to run Mouse Guard for the Saturday group. Oh, I have no experience with Mouse Guard. So in the centuries between these two games, spiders got huge. We got swole. I get the distinct impression I'm gonna get the flippers. At some, I'm gonna get like flippers or something at some point. Here marks the spot where the Minotaur King was defeated many years ago. How different or same is the map so far? The map is completely different.
Fuck your camp. The trading sucks. Is the grandpa telling the story, but Lily is taken care of by her grand. Real grandma's passed away. You know, I don't know. That's a good question because the grandma is never mentioned anywhere outside of the outside of the story, and grandpa never actually says anything. I don't know if I don't know if the grandpa ever actually uses the word grandma anywhere in the game in his narration. Like, I think that she's just a character in the game. It's interesting. I'm trying to go southeast. And I still can't go through shallow water. Wee! No, there's no Wii command. I'm sorry. How's it going, Tetra? Holy shit, it's Yoda! Do a barrel roll! <laughs> Get Gruff some Nom Nom juice. Lady Upriver have Nom Nom juice, but Gruff eat her cat one time, and now she hate Gruff. Ah! Uh... <laughs> so, Tetra, I don't know how... Uh... Well, okay, you know what? This looks like a good, this looks like a job for a pole. So, um, pole is active. So, yeah, I don't know if you're familiar with the beginning of this story or not, but Lily totally wishes her brother away, like in Labyrinth. <laughs> and then David Bowie comes and takes him away. Anybody else want to get a vote in on help the troll or fight the troll? Fight troll. <laughs> Oh, it's got, oh wow, it provides browser sources now. Interesting. I wonder if it's always provided browser sources. 
Or if that's new. That seems like it's new. I wonder if it does that for predictions now. I'll have to find that out later. No, I, I, I'm legitimately asking for it here. You're right. All right, with one vote, we are fighting the troll. Ha, you thought Gruff weak because Gruff small. Not gonna pass till Gruff gets nom nom juice. Now go on. Oh, that's stupid. Don't give me the option to fight him if you're not gonna let me fight him. Wait, there's a chest there. Can I get to that chest? Why do I feel like I can get to that chest? Hey, it's money. The uh, the money-making game gives you a piece of stamina in this, and they hosed me, like, hard. It probably took, like, nine tries for me to get the piece of stamina. Well, it's about time. You're exceptionally late, my dear. Come in, come in. We're already behind. Let's get started immediately. Welcome to Alchemy 101, an introduction to potion making and other magical food and drink. When brewing a potion, first thing you will need is a pot. Any pot will do like this one. Now, you also need four ingredients. Any four ingredients will not do. The easiest potion to make and the one we will be learning today is the health potion. All you need is an apple, a mushroom, a clover, and a tulip. Recipe. Did you bring an empty bottle? It was written in bold letters on the front page of the course syllabus. Here, you may borrow one of my bottles today, but please bring it back for our next lesson. Interact with the pot and add the four ingredients. Well, well, at least you're a quick learner. The potion looks fantastic. That concludes our first lesson, unless you have any questions. Uh... Oh, Gruff, he's the worst. Don't worry, he doesn't eat humans. Why he's sick again? Nom Nom Juice is, the... is just a basic health potion, just like the one you just made. See you next time, and don't forget to bring my bottle back. Oof. Oh, hey, we got, what do we got here? Looks like we might get, be getting a proper hook shot. Wow.
See, kids, Gruff may look scary and not the, not be the nicest, but he's not a troll. But he is a troll of his word. Oh, we got piranha plants. Money! Okay, we got a puzzle. Looks like a sliding block puzzle of some kind over there. There's all sorts of ingredients. Okay, one of six, excellent. Oh, hello there. I dug up these stones, and I have a feeling they fit together in some way. Sadly, I'm too worn out from digging to put them together. Don't tell my brother I said that. If you could drag them around and see if they fit together, I'd appreciate it. Okay, well. top. So, uh, La Mulana is on my, on my backlog, and I know, I know that it's going to be a game that I end up pulling my hair out over, but yet there's a part of me that wants to play it, like, to at least make an attempt at it. And then there's a second voice in my head that's like, but why, why do you, why do you want to play? Why do you want to subject yourself to what is probably one of the most difficult games you'll ever play? La Mulana. Hey, we got a shovel. You've been doing programming for funsies again. Ooh, what have you been programming? Wow, we're just getting gems now. Mm -hmm. 
inquiring minds want to know, what are you programming? Are you working on Zora again? But Zelda related. Is it rando related? How do I get up there? I don't think I can get up there. What is that shit? We, instead of Zoras, we have little pirates popping up in barrels. Hey kid, help! Eh. Got this other thing to do here. This fish is a monster, I can barely hold on. Grab my coat and pull me back. At it, girl, I think I got it. I can't believe it, this is the biggest fish ever. With this scaly beast, I can retire for good this time. My grandkids didn't believe my old fish stories, so I had to show them what's what. Also, fish oil is good for for inflammation. You'll understand when you're older, kiddo. I can. S this is totally the granddad telling the story. I can see you eyeing my fishing rod. Take it. I won't be needing it anymore. But like, I hate fishing mini games. God, I hate fishing mini games. Bluefin. So, what application do you see that having, if I may ask? Like, are you looking at... Oh, we can climb up here. Ah, uh, we can 
I'm down here. Okay, so we know that there's a chest up there. I said parlay to the pirates instead of my negotiating. They stole my pants. My pants! My pants? My pants. My pants, my pants, my pants, my pants. Which is melting water, so maybe Minotaurs do. That's how it works, right? Yes. Those pirates must be after my smoked fish cakes recipe. I don't think so. You know, it definitely seemed like there was going to be a method to brew potions in the original because they did give you a lot of random crap that you could just pick up. Seemingly, right? They they made use of it in other ways, but like, I always wondered about that. And it seems like this is basically just a more realized version of the original. And there's nothing wrong with that. I thought they stopped delivering packages, you know, because of the Minotaur King's return. These smoked red herrings smell delightful. Thanks for the darling delivery. The last time I ordered these, a troll guy, a troll named Gruff took them as a payment to cross his dumb bridge. That's a Bunky Island reference right there. The troll eating the red herring. Whoever wished the Minotaur King back is welcome on my boat. We all make mistakes. Well, that's good. Fuck me. Holy shit. This guy is the worst. Three of six. Seven of nine. Oh, listen.
Ooh, treasure chest. How's this compare to the original? It's got some quality of life improvements that I really appreciate. Uh, it's it's basically the original with more polish, if that makes sense. Like, I can see the original in this one. The fact that it's got a, a hook shot in it means that it's more of a Zelda game than the original one was in terms of, like, the items that it has. Um, the UI is a little cleaner. The art is different. I wouldn't say that it's entirely an improvement. Uh, just, it's... Just different. <gasps> There's a horsey! Hey there, can you help? My horse is stuck in the mud. I can't go in or I'll sink too. Do you have some kind of rope or something to get him out? I'll wait here. Please get help. <laughs> animal cruelty! Animal cruelty! Animal cruelty! Uh, find that asshole. I'll leave your horse stuck in the mud then. Ooh, it's a big coin. Called Bard and not Peta. Is that a uh, Hunger Games preference? Preference? I'm trying to build a sandcastle, but I just can't get good form. The most important thing about building a big sandcastle is a solid frame. I need shells. Do you have any shells? Uh, I do. Fuck. Well, this was a little... Okay. Also, a Peter reference. Gotcha. Oh, oh, yes. I... Yeah, I'm an idiot. Hey! We got another hot air balloon platform. Okay. You're already here. There, now that bilge eaten lassie will never get to Borkla. Aye, not without bombs, she won't. Keep it down, you barnacle brain. The pipsqueak might hear you. 
If my stone stack and blisters are for naught because of your big mouth, I'm making you shark bait, savvy? Aye, aye, consider these salty lips sealed, sir. Good, besides, our bombs are kept safely at our beach hideout, so unless... Oi, sir, you might want to... I'm talking here, you scallywag. As I was saying, blimey, it's the little landlubber. Give no quarter, baby. The writing is a lot better in this one. The jokes were cute in the first one, but they didn't really land well. And so far, I have chuckled a few times already in just this first first evening. Covering quite a bit of ground. I'm talking here, I'm talking here. Well, aren't you a sweet little plum? Are you lost, dearie? Sniff, sniff. Oh, potion ingredients. It warms my old heart to see a little lady like yourself taking up the fine art of butchery. Kids these days would rather fiddle around with a stone tablet game and learn the mystic arts. Anyway, I know just what to teach you. With this potion, you can cheat death itself. I should mention that your little belly can only hold one rejuvenation potion at a time. Oh, what were the ingredients again? Hmm, that's right. Combine an orange, seaweed, chrysanthemum, and starfish. Oh, I lack a bottle. Oh no. Hey now. Well, now that I know that that chest is there. Cox, but yeah. They were they were doing fine there for a minute. They're all awful, yeah. It seems like the only good ISPs are the little local ones and we don't have a little local one. Four of six. This is going to be the pirate's hideout.
Goodness me, I, the least you could do is knock before you before really intruding into one's abode. What discourtesy among today's youth, like wild animals, I must say. Are you kidding, Grandpa? It's a monkey. He should talk like a monkey. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh, stop changing the story, Chris. I like the smart monkey. Pardon me, I must have swallowed a piece of banana peel out of where during brunch. Now to teach you some matters, prudent behavior shan't be tolerated. I have to pick him back up and throw him, is that what's saying? Ow, apparently not. This should be bombs. Hey, it's bombs! Now I'm curious what all I can do with bombs, like what opened up. I know there were some spots in the original, in the opening city already. Yeah, there's the obvious, oh wow, he's throwing shit through the bomb, through the rocks, that's crap. You know, I went from not really having a lot of money to suddenly I'm I'm doing pretty okay for money. Like a little mini dungeon. Man. Money.
The music is much more subtle in this game than in the original. Which is kind of interesting. I honestly would have thought that they would have gotten a little more bold with the music. Like, it's never the subtle... I don't know, the, the, game, the first game and this one both kind of... Neither one had, like, a memorable musical theme to them, right? And it's, you know, if I think back about, like, Zelda, it's never the... It's never the, the subtle songs to remember. It's... It's kind of the bolder ones. I guess that's not true. Like, maybe... Zelda's Lullaby is pretty subdued, and it's a classic. Okay, go left, I can get to the balloon. I want to go back to the starting area and blow open some rocks that I saw. So I need to go south. I'm halfway convinced, Tetra, that Cox, is, Cox does some kind of a nightly update for their hardware or something. I don't have any actual data to back that up, but... It does seem to happen in the same window every night, and I've checked my network to make sure that there's nothing, like, pushing a huge chunk of data during that time frame. But it seems like they've calmed down again. So that's good. All right, Bridge, you have a good night. Thanks for stopping by. Energy crystal, okay.
Really? I'm looking at the preview and it looks okay. And I haven't had a dropped frame in a while. You might want to reload. Oh, sweet. Excellent. We got for... We need one piece of heart yet. Wow, I have no idea what the blue gems are for, but uh, they seem to be exclusively from dig spots. It definitely looks like the flippers are in this game. So how are the kitties, Tetra? How are they doing? You know I'm going to ask. good. Ruby's not happy dieting, but sorry. Yeah. Is it just restricting caloric intake, or is there something else to it? They just beg for food. Oh, that's the worst. I'm sorry.
Wow, I think I can actually go get the bottle yet. Sunkiss Canyon. I have a bomb. I swear this sounds like a song straight out of Zelda. Dun 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 dun. Now is Ruby then trying to take food from Mocha? Has that happened yet? I hope not. was a smart move. On your part. That's the first big rock that didn't have something under it, either a dig spot or a chest. Second. Maybe I already got them. Possible. I think the map might be bigger in this one. The map definitely seems to be more thought out in this one, like things are more deliberately placed. They were, the last map was, was large, but things just seemed to be kind of like haphazardly stitched together in spots. Wow, some coins went everywhere.
No idea what to do with the song doors yet, but we'll find out, I'm sure. I am really glad that the first game saw the success that it did on the Switch. It really makes my heart happy when an indie dev like I don't know. There's there's a there's a part of me that has always like wanted to try my hand at making a game even though I'm sure it's it's far more difficult a concept than I could ever imagine, right? And so it just makes my heart happy to see that, like, this game from this tiny team, like, they, they made it, you know? And it's such a love letter to a game that I already loved. Oh, Honeycomb. Golden Honeycomb, I bet some bees would be interested in that. Oh. No, no, not the bees. I need to find a clean sound rip of that. The hardest part of use of coming up with sound effects for redemptions and stuff is honestly finding like clean versions of them. Alrighty. You have a good night, Tetra. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. So many coins! there I thought I could roll through those trees This way now that I have the bomb. Oh. 
Well, that looks like a dungeon entrance to me. All right, we got the shortcut. golden honeycomb. go up here now that it you know what aha I could jump down there and go up to this chest not entirely see but okay nevertheless chest got I'm pretty sure he's also referring to the hook shot, but I don't have it yet. Yet. 
Suddenly, a young knight heard a thunderous croaking sound. Frogs from Periwinkle Woods had traveled downstream. Ew, I hate frogs. Honey badgers are just so much cuter. Stop changing the story, you... Weeboid. Oh, money. Money, money, money. I wonder if that's a dig spot there. If that's what's hiding. Shadow of the Find out. Yay. I feel like there should be something. Well, ah, giant turtle. Are you Morkla, the ancient one? Ah, ah, achoo. Not that it matters, but yes, we are Morkla. We've been alone for many years, so we talk to ourselves. Are you another one of those pirates? I'm not a pirate. I need help finding the Minotaur King's Labyrinth. He took my brother, and I need to rescue him. Not that it matters, but yes, we know where it is. But we feel strange. Our inside and outside hurts. Never mind, our sneeze went away. Oh, gross. Pirates bring snappy sea critters into our waters. Use your fishing rod and cast your line into the ripples around our pool. Fish the critters out, then we will help you. Be some pants. Mm-hmm. 
You did it. Not that it matters. Come and stand before me. <laughs> hey, money. I like money. You need a key to enter the labyrinth. I ate it long ago. Enter our shell to find the key and get our nasty... Or don't, it doesn't matter. I was honestly expecting him. Okay. So we're clearly getting the... Hmm. This has notes of a dungeon from Link's Awakening. Those sprites are way cooler. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this has got heavy notes of, of the Awakening Dungeon theme. I think of which one it was. First one, probably. It's like the wiring puzzle, except it's not. Shit. Okay. I have a clever puzzle.
Oi, what's this? A little girl they waltzed about me humble new abode. This here tortoise shell be claimed by one hook Willie. Turn back now, lest you want to become chopped chum. Oh, this is the beginning. Okay. I don't have a key. Okay. Back this way, I assume. Do we have a map yet in here? Oh, we do. We have a dungeon map now. Oh, thank you.
dungeon map was a thing that was sorely missing from the first one, and I'm glad that it's in this one. Okay. Avast ye! This be as far as ye go, young lass. Draw your blade, little scallywag. It be duelin' time. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it's floaters. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's adorable. Giant skull and bones. The empty eye sockets stared back at her.
Ow, asshole. Fuck! Uh, that's gonna be one of the eyes, right? It was fashioned in the shape of a lidless eye. Perhaps if it's in the skull, doors empty eye socket. Yep. That looks like it's bombable. Bombable? It is. Excellent. I like I like heart containers. They're so nice.
I'll take it. I like money. Where have I not been yet? Over here. Man, lots of four floor puzzles in this one, or floor traps in this one. Like the game knows, knows my weakness. me off a little bit there, but got it. Gadoosh! Gadoosh! After braving many dangers, our young hero finally reached the heart of Morkla's shell. Well, it's just a pool of water. If I were Lily, I'd throw a rock in there. Yeah! Oh ho ho, you know, there are times when it is best not to disturb the... Rock, rock, rock!
fresh fleece. Our deadly pet octopus emerged from the waters, ready to follow orders. Squeeze, tear, devour. Wow. Some tentacles. Got him. Ah, ah, a chew. Not that it matters, but we feel better. Then why are you still sneezing? We are allergic to something. Children, perhaps. <laughs> That's a that's a mood. That's a whole ass mood right there. It doesn't matter to us. We don't care. Aha, clever girl. Head west to the Sunkiss Canyons. There you will find another piece of the key. Or don't. Nothing matters. Everything comes and goes except us. We can swim now. Pretty sure that gets us access to spots we didn't have before.
Five of six. Pretty sure it's map. Another balloon spot. Can't get there yet. Okay, so I get what we have to do there. Okay. I don't like it, but I see it. I would really like to find the sixth frog statue. to find the top here I walked to the right nope Is that it down there really Potion Brewer. This is the Potion Brewer.
Okay, well, that's not the shop either. I'm gonna see if I have enough shells to get this kid. Maybe this is the shop up. Ooh, another star. Still don't have enough. Uh... Okay. Oh, there's the missing one. Musical door. Nothing. Okay. One of six, grr. Excellent. So I'm going to need to get the hook shot for that, it looks like.
Ow. Interesting, the enemies are random. Until this moment, I thought they were... Hmm. Okay. Nothing, huh? Apparently after you kill a spot enough, it, uh... Stops... Stops respawning. Interesting, cracked pots, okay. First one of those. Come back because I want to buy the stuff in that village. I will pay your exorbitant fees. There, you have your extortion now. It'll take me a minute to build it, though.
Wow, that is quite the sand castle. Yay! All right, so I think that puts me at three. Right, yep. All right, back home. Uh, I don't have 200 gold. Uh. Murderous rage. Yep, okay. I swear that looks like it should be bomb. Been in here, right? Yep, sure have. No, 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 they raised the bridge to the sunken, the Sunkist Canyon. Well, I was at the festival. They must have heard about the return of the Minotaur King. I got something, got something I can hit that wheel on the other side, drop the bridge. Need the bow. shot spots
Wait, there's a crack in the wall. Excellent. Funny. That's a bow challenge. Go get us a bow. I will take quarter hearts.
Hello again, my race was so popular at the fair I decided to set up a permanent stand. The game is a lot tougher since last time. Are you fast enough to collect 25 flags this time? Thanks. Miss Nancy's Flower Shop. I'm not dandelion. Oh, boo. Boo hiss. I don't know what the blue gems are for yet. But I really hope they're worth something. spot where we can plant something. I don't think it's the same spot. You stand. I 
Yeah, this looks a lot like, you know, what would be like the Minotaur King's castle. The place stood in awe. She beheld the great labyrinth gates for the first time. She knew there was no entry without the powerful key made just for this lock alone. Her quest continued. Okay. You saved me, thank you so much. Maybe I'll see you back in town. Oh, be careful, the Sunkiss Canyons have always been a treacherous place. stand. <laughs> has got to be a can't go there yet. Okay. Hmm. All right. All right, game. You win this round. If I ever find seeds, man. Yep, okay, so it's not the explodey type, got it. Okay.
can already tell you that that's what goes in those statues. One of six. Okay. What the fuck? Oh, it's that dude again. Oh, they look different in this one. Lily approached the mysterious entrance of the old, beautiful stonework. Magical maidens and proud knights stood watchful, ready to come alive at any moment. Wow, it sounds so amazing, Grandpa. Bet it's even cooler inside. Oh, you're probably right, however. We have an owl now, shit. So the hearsay is true. Water and heat long shaped these lands, but this temple was first. Only melodious winds can its doors be traversed. Would you not like to never hear what I... Would you not like to... <laughs> Did you not fail to misunderstand what you just heard? Remember, those who feel like giving up only need to look back to see how far they've come. Grandpa, that was nice, but also kind of weird. There in the dusty canyons sands lay an ancient bone. Okay. Alright, we're starting to get into some danger territory here. Oh, fuck me. Push blocks, please. Fuck, I screwed up. Okay, second.
Hold up. Oh, this is devious. Okay, one second. Nope. Okay. Fact. There we go. No, it wasn't what I thought it was. But that's okay. We're looking for a f mag uh, magical instrument of some kind. I'm assuming will not be an ocarina because that would be too much Zelda reference, but will probably be like a flute. Hey, it's the traitor. See just how bad he wants to hose me this time. Cool. Uh, not yet, but, but he's giving me the blue crystals this time. I think they've got to be worth something.
They are a hitherto yet m misunderstood resource. Ooh, what do we got going on here? As if the bandits weren't enough trouble, now we gotta deal with rock monsters? Here's something about the mayor. What's the plan? Rock creatures? I haven't seen any rock creatures. Cough. Are you kidding? They're crushing all our juicy cactus. Oh, those rock creatures! <laughs> By an evil bard. What's a bard? I don't know. How dare he? Please travel east. There you will find the dastardly bard. Yes. Yes. I'll be back for that bottle. Yeah, it's the final recipe from my recipe of month subscription. Looks like a new recipe for an old favorite mushroom soup. Let's see here. Toadstool, slime fish, canyon wisp, clam. We have to head east, huh? Okay, we're heading. Yep, I get where we're heading.
31 of them. This has been a better song than some of the ones I've had. Ooh, oh, I'm so close to getting the... Three of six. I know I could go... I could go right there, but... Or east there, but I think about... I'm gonna go down and go east, just over there. I'm kinda curious. Ah, it's a secret. Ooh. I like these kinds of secrets. Or it's just like here, have some money. Best kinds of secrets. See what else we got over here. That looks like a boss fight. If I ever saw one. Ah, so they're like Staphos. Okay. Ow, could you not do that? Thank you. Game. Now oh, the enemies are dropping those blue crystals, okay.
Lily found a combat scroll. If she finds someone to decipher it, she will learn a new move. Oh, we'll have to see if that was worth it or not. I don't know. Woe is you, lass, for you've been led astray. Again, he's used cunning to ensnare and betray. It's a trap! Silly girl, I thank you for coming here, but more importantly, for freeing the Minotaur King. What was it like standing in the presence of such power and majesty? Long was he banished, yet they say his abilities remain extraordinary. I think she'll stand in the way of his return. Thank you, young warrior. It was crammed to that cage. I was attacked unexpectedly by the misguided mage. As a reward, I will gift you with the instrument most with an instrument most wondrous, a flute with a voice that to all sounds quite Again, didn't Lily get one of those flutes that looked like a potato last time? Nope, you're thinking of the other stories. Yeah, well, I think the bard should give Lily a cool guitar. Boring! How about an accordion like the one you have, Grandpa? Oh, very well. The Grateful Bard offered Lily a guitar. Absolutely. What? Wow. Well done. They incorporated more Zelda elements. I love this game. It's a really good sequel that improves upon the original in every way, and this one really, really manages to, to, to accomplish that.
do I get up there? This way. I mean, I don't want to buy it, but I will buy it if I need it. like his place has a second Money. More money. Pizza heart. The only thing I'm missing is the... <laughs> thing that I can't think of the name of right now because my brain is dumb. Pomegranates, that's what I'm missing. Ah, hello, you do. Well, there are some things you should know before entering the arena. Contest lasts 10 rounds. You can quit after any round, make it to the end, 
the grand prize. It costs 50 gold coins to enter. Would you like to participate? Yes. All right. Alright. Bugs are gone. Is she wielding a sword or a fly swatter? That kind of fighting earns her five gold. Gang of ruthless, toothless pirates ready to teach the land lover a lesson. Yes, I want to keep going. Blimey, those salty dogs aren't telling no tales anytime soon, Savvy. The young swashbucklers earned five gold doubloons. Don't go off burying that now. <laughs> ah! Fucking hell. Ow. That hurt a lot, okay. I'm shocked! Shocked! Giant frogs, okay. Scythe wielding specters. I don't know if I. Fuck my life. Holy shit. Undead Axe Knights. Oh my lord, okay.
Oh, they were tough. Beat him. Just for a piece of heart. That's a lot for a piece of heart. Oh. Okay. Hey, I like money. All right, money. Yay! Only well, someone had drawn me a bow. Enjoy your retirement. Oh, hey, it's the archaeologist again. He's looking for the ancient bones, I bet. Monsters ran my dig site. Now many of the lizard bones are missing. There used to be a lot more ribs, but they're probably scattered all over the lands by now. There's no way I'm out doing my twin brother without those bones. He's an amazing archaeologist. I only hope it's to find all 20 lost bones. Okay. I had a sneaking suspicion. That I was gonna have to give those to him. Four of six.
Hey there, welcome to my dojo. I'm Danny, Master of Combat. I see you have a combat scroll in your inventory. I can decipher it for you. Combat scroll contains pictures of a special move that would make Lily a better hero. Awesome, I hope Lily learns the ground pound attack from the first scroll. That attack is cool, but I have an even better idea. What about an extended roundhouse, Grandpa? That would be useful. The special attack that will help Lily the most is... Mm. So there are apparently four scrolls. Wow, you dick. Ah, we're doing the minecart fun now. Okay. Oh. Flower moon heart sun. Flower moon. Oh shit. Flower moon heart. Flower. Wow. Fuck. 
Those freaking worms are pretty awful. Err, sure. just hoping you'd be something better. I have the key. I don't. Sunflower, got to be moon. Sunflower, moon heart. Wasn't sure if it would give that to me or not. Hmm. 
Nope. That wasn't what I wanted to do. Help. Oof. Shit. At least there's a low penalty for death. Welcome back, Brit. Sorry I couldn't sleep, but welcome back. Uh, well, we cleared out the first dungeon. We are in the second dungeon now. Um, the first dungeon was inside a giant turtle. And we fought a giant octopus and cleared out a bunch of pirates. Um, we have then ventured into the desert. Gotten quite a few heart pieces. We're making some really, really solid progress. Oh, and I won the battle in the Colosseum, so... Heart pizzas. Yep, pizza heart. We are now in the Desert Temple, uh, which we... They gave us our choice of instrument 
to play in order to open things up, but uh, your choices were... Grandpa was like, oh, it's a flute, right? And uh, the, the kids were like, no, 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 clearly it's a guitar or an accordion, so I picked guitar. And the, uh, and the really cute thing is, okay, so there's been a ton of Zelda references. A lot of them. But this might be one of the neatest ones yet. <laughs> it's got the ocarina! Music bars! I love it! Uh, I just want to point out that this, uh, so I, something that I really, po I, I said earlier, uh, this game is a hands down improvement in every respect over the other. Oopsie. The music is better than the original. It is, oh crap, I guess I, it is, it is more subdued than the original, but that isn't to say that it's bad, just that it's different. I think overall the musical compositions themselves are better. All right, so let's see. Moon, sun, flower, heart. Moon, sun, flower, heart. Sun, flower, heart. Sunflower heart. Sunflower heart. Sun. The game almost threw those uh, singing stones at me again, but it let me pick singing stones or sliding block puzzle. And I totally picked uh, the sliding block puzzle. We are definitely getting the hook shot in this uh, dungeon, by the way. Oh, is it lunchtime already? Oh, what the fuck, game.
This will be the mini boss, by the way. This isn't even the full boss. God damn it, I didn't hit him a single time on those. Got him. That's gonna be the hook shot. It's a yo yo, though. Oh, and I remember how I said that we were gonna get the uh, the the flippers brid? Uh, we did. We got the flippers in the turtle, but they're not flippers, they're floaties. <laughs> Floaties, yep, floaties. This has been the first dungeon that had those tower those flower tiles. Something I noticed also by the way is that they this one has a dungeon map whereas the other one didn't. So it isn't the same it isn't the same hero. It's 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 a, 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 the grandpa, of course, is again telling the story to his grandkids, but the idea is that it's a, uh, it's a girl who was named after the hero from hundreds of years ago. And I still can't believe she labyrinthed her brother.
It is excellent. It's it's absolutely great. Ah, okay. Now we definitely have to have Oh, you shithead. You fuckers. Are you fucking kidding? Okay, so this is another one like where I have to do both sides again. Okay. Now we can go up here and switch. the exit it and then I just walk right off the I'm I, I are good at game okay getting bodied off of those tiny ass platforms by a bat though is really kind of annoying just say it You believe it now? Like you didn't believe it before? Like I was just lying to you? No, it's a thing. It definitely exists. Oh, fuck, fuck. What the? This is just some bullshit right here.
No, fuck. Fucking key. Oh, fuck you, game. Okay, so this one is flower, moon. Oh, this one's sun. Flower, moon, heart, sun. Flower, moon, heart, sun. Those new puzzles where it's got the, the different symbol tiles is, I love those. Those are fantastic. Just, those are great new additions. Excellent. Okay, so 
that'll get me into the portal. Is that where I want to go? No yet. We're gonna go through this door over here first. Ah, good thing I did. Oh shit. <laughs> Not quite. There we go. That's annoying. No hearts, huh? Okay. I see how you are, game. Sun flower heart. Sun. Fuck you. Moon, sun, flower, heart. What? 
but... Okay, so I don't understand why this one is not working. Oh, moon, sun, flower, heart, moon, sun, flower, heart, moon, sun, flower, heart. Oh, shit. Sun, flower, heart. Heart. Oh my god. Heart. Meh. Sunflower heart. Moon sun flower. Heart, heart, sunflower heart, sunflower heart. Wow, that was a pain in the ass, but also awesome. Holy shit. Thank you. 
Got him. Second part of the key. Okay, so that leaves us with the... Thank you. That was a fun boss. It took me a little bit to figure out exactly what was what, but once you ripped away his shield and got him stationary, you could just sit there and wail on him for a bit. Meanwhile, the enemy's wily plans were also unfolding. What do you think, my boy? Isn't this place magnificent? It's so cool, I only wish there was more f to do for, you know, fun. It just so happens I know a game played at old in days of old. Wanna learn it? Sure, but how? You didn't bring anything to... Whoa! We'll play a game of catch. Stand over there. <laughs> this is merely basics, but it's still quite music. Hey, I'm good at this. I knew you would be. You were an extraordinary. You were extraordinary, Chris. That's why fate brought you here. Why do you really? Wow, do you really think so? I know so. It's why everyone was envious of you, especially Lily. Siblings tend to be the worst of them. Lily and I had fun together, but we'd fight a lot too. I guess now I know why. Cause I was right. I'm the coolest. <laughs> you feel superior now. Just wait until this labyrinth is yours. You'll rule all of this. Doesn't that sound wonderful? Totally. I'm so gonna visit home to show off that I'm... <sighs> visit home? <laughs> Don't be silly. There's no one there for you in Blossomdale. There's too. Grandma, I bet she's worried about me. We spoke of this before. Your grandmother's happy you are gone. She never loved you. That's not true. She lets me play all day and makes me soup and reads me bedtime stories. What better way to put a tired child to rest than with warm stew and sleepy tales? No whiny Chris to fight with his sister and drive them both mad. But I'm not like her. Enjoy spending all my time. I enjoy spending all my time with you. Is it home, my dear boy? You are home. Being here with all the Minotaurs wouldn't be so bad, I guess. What if Lily comes to try and rescue me? She never knows when to quit. You are right about your sister, but are asking the wrong question. When the flower-haired brat inevitably does arrive, will you want to be rescued? Um, I'm having too much fun here. That's why- that's my young prince. Lily now had two pieces of the broken labyrinth key. Search for the third and final piece begins. Oh, this game even has an owl. <laughs> Hoot! Have thought a young lass would be the one to take the key piece from this temple. To find the last piece, head northeast to the Periwinkle Woods. The great owl is expecting you. Who? His knowledge of the broken key will help you greatly. I hoot, we meet again. Alright. On that note, let's see who is streaming. I am tired. Thank you so much for watching tonight. I really hope that you enjoyed it. I uh, I hope to see you back tomorrow night. I think I'm going to work on Blossom Tales and finish that while I iron out the technical details of Parasite Eve 2. And then uh, I'll do Parasite Eve 2 and then Final Fantasy 7. But yeah, so I uh, hope to see you tomorrow night. And until then, I'm going to raid... We're going to raid Grayskull 83. Currently running through the Big 20, so... That should be fun. Sleep well, Brid. Have a good night, everybody. Thanks for watching.